up, winners? Welcome back to another video at Stay Winning Podcast. I'll be giving away this bottle opener. Let me know if this is better or worse than previous videos. I definitely would appreciate your feedback. That way I can keep making quality content. Now, thank you so much for 1,020 subscribers, winners. I appreciate you all. We're currently only 433 hours away from the first tier of monetization on YouTube. So please kindly hit the like button, leave a comment so we can get the algorithm going uh, and get this video out even more. All right, so let's begin with the price of Cardano over the last seven days and not much movement at all. It began at 24 cents and still sits at 24 cents with only a slight movement on the extra decimal. So if we take a look at adastat.net, we can confirm the price is at 24 cents, the market cap 8.6 billion US dollars with a circulating supply currently of a little over 35 billion ADA and total stake 22.8 billion ADA. So that's a huge percentage of staked Cardano compared to the circulating supply which makes me very bullish on Cardano. And again, one of my favorite things is that it's not locked. So it makes it easy. And I definitely like that about Web3. Now, currently there's 2.6 million holders with pools to stake just under 3,000 and the next epic record in as little as two days or just over two days. So as I mentioned last week, the gap between the transactions and the amount was closing. But we can see that this week, that gap has started to separate again, which makes you very, very bullish and less guilty about accumulating Cardano at this price. So if you wanna check that out, that's adastat.net. Now I wanna integrate a new tool into these videos, which is Tap Tools. I made a video on Tap Tools previously, so I'll link it up above or below so for you to check it out and their NFT as well. So you can use Tap Tools and check out the trending tokens. So these are all the tokens that are trending within the Cardano ecosystem. You can find Snake, you can find World Mobile Token on here, and the trending NFT. So this is a little insight about the NFTs that we'll be talking about next week in next week's recap video. Uh, and I mention this because a lot of new followers on Twitter are from Polygon and Ethereum. So welcome, winners. Thank you so much for the support. Uh, I hope you find a little bit of new insight in Cardano with the tools that I'm showing you on the screen. So let's move on to the JPEG store. Over the last seven days, you can see that the volume is down a little over 30% and no project necessarily stands out over that record. But next week, we'll definitely be mentioning some projects. Now we can move on to CNFT tools. So take a look at the upcoming mints. So in the next seven days, we have Dragon Generation, BBC Pass, the one I'm excited about, Cardano Press Wapus. So they're breeding Web 3 and Web 2. I made a video on them last week, so be sure to check it out. I'll go ahead and link it up above as well. And then we have apprentices coming up later this week. So a lot of projects are minting this week. And I think that has to do with the upcoming Web3 event, NFT XLV. So NFT XLV is making Web3 accessible for everyone. I will be there this weekend. It is a 3D event. However, I'll be there only on Saturday. So I'll arrive on Saturday morning. I'll leave Saturday night. I hope to get a lot of interviews and meet some of you. So if you see me and recognize me, please come say hi. I'm going to go ahead and give this out. All right. To the first person that comes to say hello and mentions this video. Um, it's brand new. Just took out a package, but the package was dirty. So for recording and camera purposes, just want to show that to you winners. So I'll be giving it out at NFTXLV later this week and luckily it fits in my wallet so i can go through security at the airport with it i hope i'll let you guys know i mean you'll see me there and you can ask so i'll definitely be at this event this week and hope to get a lot of interviews for you guys and maybe live stream for those that are not attending so let me know in the comments below if you're attending if you're not attending or what you want to see me record while i'm out there uh, if there's an interview you want me to get or someone you want me to meet or a project you want me to showcase, then go ahead and let me know. Um, again, that's NFT XLV taking place in Las Vegas this weekend. So some of the speakers on here, of course, Charles Hoskinson and Eddie Cara. 
So Eddie Cara is the head of Platypus Cyberpunks, great project that's bridging real estate uh, and NFTs. So I've made a video about them before. I'll go ahead and link it up above as well. But let me go over the last tool here, um, which is the open scene of TIO. So over the last seven days, the peak volume was just under 700,000 Cardano, and that took place yesterday. And, and I noticed a lot of that is because Dirtbirds is building and Platypus Cyberpunks continue to build as well. And they're providing a lot of utility and benefits to their holders. So a lot of people have been picking those up lately within the next, I mean, within the last 48 hours. Hence that little spike. So it's very, very good to see that those two projects will be attending NFT XLV. So if you want to get to know the teams, you can go ahead and check them out there. Let me go over the list of the exhibitors. Let's see here. Input out Global, Hosky Token, Whimsy Estates, Cardano Foundation, Graffiti Park, Clay Nation, Inmates, Royal Chess Club, Future Fest. I mean, the list goes on. Cornucopius, one of the biggest. If you're into gaming, uh, you definitely want to check out their booth. Um, Jet Chicken, Alley Cats. I hope to get an interview with Alley Cats. And then, you know, Goombles as well, Dirt Birds. So a lot of great projects that will be taking place in NFT XLV. Nice to see a college group showcasing what they're working on and what they're about and their interest in Web3. So that's very exciting as well. Winners, that's a recap for this week's Cardano video. So just wanted to make that announcement that I'll be attending. I hope to see you there and see who wins the bottle opener. Not much, but hey, it's a start, right? So winners, thank you so much for tuning in. Again, please hit the like button and subscribe.